everybody welcome back to a new video from breezy organization we are on here today with new releases so every single week we bring brand new digital planner releases for you guys and today we have got some really really fun new ones that you guys are going to be able to play with and i think really really enjoy if you're new here to the channel we talk about all things digital planning and productivity using the ipad and apple pencil however this will work across many different devices so if you'd like to try before you buy you can download a free notes planner and stickers from breezyorganization.com and make sure it works on your device and maybe give it a go to see if this is something that you might really benefit from. We have two releases today. I'm going to start with the stickers and then we have some brand new inserts for you all. So let's dive in. Okay, so this is the sticker release that we have for you today, and it is Farmhouse. So if you've been around Breeze Organization for very long, you know that we love Farmhouse, and we offer lots of different Farmhouse stickers and planner styles. Um, so this is our um, third release of different Farmhouse stickers. So you'll find this in the shop in the links down below or on Etsy, but you have lots and lots of Farmhouse stickers and lots and of play stickers that you can do in this kit as well. So we have this really pretty open window that's great for just adding in a big decor statement piece. And we have hashtag mom mode. We have farmer's market bag, which the farmer's market does come off. So you can use it as a different type of bag or you can use the farmer's market on top. Uh, I'm a fixer upper girl, one of my favorites. A cute little light, like if you're wanting to mark when you are cleaning all your fixtures or just if you wanna use a cute decor piece. Uh, prepare dinner, a really cute storage stack of boxes, some cutting boards, chocolate chip cookies, weekend adventure, and then really cute plates for washing dishes or dinner party. Lots of fun stuff that you can use with that. Uh, wash dishes, a stack of some waffles. Uh, you had me at shiplap, another one of my absolute favorite little quotes. Um, a little cheese board, organize something. So you can use that with lots of these different stickers. And then it has like um, rice and flour and oats. And it's very, very detailed stickers on here. Um, a really, really pretty decor piece with a chair and then friends night. We have an empty frame here. I'm gonna show you what you can do with that here in just a moment. And then you have a really pretty fireplace and then some utensils, 15 minute clean, which I love to do all the time at our house. And you can just put that into your daily um, or monthly or weekly as well. And we have a really cute new laundry sticker. Um, sometimes you may have a laundry sticker already, but you get tired of using the same sticker. So when it's something as common as laundry, <laughs> you can definitely have a few of those. A really pretty um, like concrete looking candle. And then we have some little spices and a beautiful white refrigerator. So I love the theme and the colors of this kit. Um, we have the hex codes up here at the top, but there's really not a lot, a lot of color going on. It's pretty neutral. So it's going to go with any sticker pack, which is awesome for some of those main stickers about washing dishes, cooking, organizing something, 15 minute clean, all of those, you can use them on any of your spreads because they're going to match your other stickers, which I, I love having a basic um, neutral theme like that. One of the really, really fun stickers in this kit is this beautiful fireplace. You can use it lots of different ways, but I liked pairing it with this frame. So I'm gonna show you something that I made so I just played around with this just a little bit, but look how cute this could be. I absolutely loved how um, this turned out, um, but I thought this was so cute. I added in the window and the chair and the little bag. And then over here, all I did was took one of my pictures and cropped it to fit within this frame and put it there above the fireplace. Now, again, you could use this fireplace for lots of different things. We have different wreaths in the shop that you can sit on top of there. You could set this whole decor piece on top of here. You could even set these cutting boards on top of here. Lots of fun stuff that you can do to play around with this kit but um, I thought this was just really, really fun and to be able to add that personal touch, like adding your picture in there, just lots and lots of fun. If you just enjoy playing with your digital planner, this is a really fun set to have. So this is the Farmhouse Volume 3 and you'll find that again linked down below and um, on breezyorganization.com and on Etsy. And then uh, for our second product release today are inserts. So uh, something with our brand new planner here that we offer, we allow you to have an empty um, weekly and daily spreads so you can add in whatever insert works right for you. So I'll show you 
some for example this was mine for last week this is one uh, planner layout that I had and then um, the week before I needed something different so this is the layout that I had for the week before that. And then the week before that, I needed something different. It's really, really fun that each and every week, it can be something totally different and whatever fits your needs. So we have some new layouts that you can use. Now to do this, what you're gonna do is go to one of your links. So say I click on, so say I click on November, and then I need to get to a week, uh, weekly layout. All I do is hit one of these gray dots over here and it's gonna take you to an empty weekly page. And then all you have to do is insert one of the inserts from this bundle. So I'm gonna pull up by lifting up at the bottom. Uh, I'm gonna bring my little bar up and then I'm gonna pull over my files to the right hand side. And I already have the file open with the new inserts. So from here, all you're gonna do is pick portrait or landscape. I'm using a landscape planner, so I'm gonna pick a landscape insert, but that does not mean you have to use landscape. You could totally um, customize these to be able to fit if you wanted to use the portrait style as well. And I'll get into that in just a minute. Uh, but to show you what one of them uh, looks like, you can pull over, just drag and drop. And then you're just gonna fill it to whatever part of the screen you want it to fill. And then from here, we have um, a letter, monthly um, letters and numbers, and then you're just gonna drag and drop and just decorate the page however you want. And, and you can also use some of our shape inserts um, that allow you to customize work to-dos, menu to-dos, um, so much customization in this planner, it's unbelievable. So um, I've showed you how to drag and drop. Now I'm gonna show you a few of the new inserts and how I uh, very lightly decorated them and started them so you can get some ideas. So let me walk you through the inserts we have for today. So starting off with our landscape, we have a really cute tag. We have a really cute tag insert. I thought that was just really fun and really different. And then we have another arch uh, insert, which we have not done in the past. So I thought this one was really, really fun and different. And if you didn't want this many arches, you can always customize these by clicking on the image icon, clicking on the insert, and then hit crop. You can move these down to just four or just two, or even make it just one and put them however you want staggered over the page. You can definitely customize these lots of different ways. And then our third version for our landscape is another really fun one. So my idea with this was to do these Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, kind of as the work week, and then do this one as the weekend. Of course, you can use this as notes or something different. You can definitely rearrange things however you like, but that was my thought process going into that one. Um, and then we have the one that I showed you at the beginning. It just have, um, you have six days here, so you're, we try to do a lot of our stickers to have weekend. So if you don't want to put Saturday and Sunday and you just want to have six blocks, that allows you to do Monday through Friday and then do Saturday, Sunday, or just weekend on one um, rectangle or square spot. And then we have a fun circle one, just changing it up from the norm and seeing how people use these to keep track of everything during their week. I just think it's really fun to play with lots of different shapes. And then we also have another version of the tag that's a little bit more like even and symmetrical. So this way you have six again, Monday through Friday, using a weekend approach to this one. But again, you can cut these off. You can do lots of different things with them if you want to play with them in a new way. Now to show you the portrait options we have. Um, so these are basically going to be the same layouts, um, but they're going to be in portrait orientation. So this one does give you eight. Um, of the rectangles instead of just six. This is your arch look. It gives you a lot more room. You could move this up and use it down here, or you could just make them two. So what you could do is crop and make these come up here. And then you can hit it and duplicate it. And then what we're going to do is hit crop again, and we're just going to keep two more. So that gives us six. And you can stagger these or do whatever you want, or you could fill them up in the page like that. So we have lots of different options. I was thinking you'd do something really, really big, or a memo board, or some instax, or something really big, or move this on top and do that stuff along the bottom. Lots of different options with these inserts. And then we have another version. This one just has a bunch of rectangles 
rectangles over here to the side. So you have six of um, your rectangles that you have spots to put the names of the week in. And then we have the tag one, which turned out really, really cute in portrait. I love that. I think that one's going to be lots of fun. And then we have another tag one going all the way along the side. And then we have the circles for the portrait. So lots and lots that you can play with, make it your own and just have fun, which is what I love about digital planning because you're actually getting something done by planning stuff and being productive, but yet it's fun too. Now I'm just gonna give you a few um, examples of how I've used the new inserts, maybe to give you like a little bit of inspiration or a jump off point. Um, these are not completed spreads. They're basically, I just sat down and played with the inserts for a little bit to give you guys some ideas. Um, so here was one for September that I came up with. Um, I did stagger the um, arches like I, talk, like I talked about where I just made that insert in half and I put four down here and four up here so I love the looks of that I think that turned out really really cute it allows you to have a title up here and then some um, ones that need to go on the bottom So this one just fits really really well with it down here at the bottom Here is another version. I didn't add any stickers to this, but just to show you Monday through Friday and then the weekend, you can make this even bigger and add in um, a calendar and highlight which week specifically it is, add some in stacks or some big statement stickers or uh, some of our widget shapes down here to keep track of the menu, your work list. Like here's an idea of using some a big sticker statement. Here's an idea of using a lot more of the widgets down here at the bottom to keep you on track. Here is another idea using some of our new numbers um, that you can just throw in the, your numbers in the um, insta or in the insert as well. Here's another idea. You could put what month it is really, really big, add some dots maybe, um, and then you've got this really, really, really cute um, lemon pack that we released a couple of weeks ago um, that you can either do journaling or just plan out your week. And here's a look at what the circles would look like with some days input in there. And then just imagine all these really cute stickers that you can put around it. I think the options are going to be really, really fun. I can't wait to sit down and play with these a little bit more myself and figure out what other kind of things that I can do and adding the stickers and the widgets and stuff along with these new inserts. I think they're going to be lots of fun and just change it up. The variety is the spice of life. And I definitely want to make sure you guys have tons of different options that you can use and to make digital planning fresh and fun every single time that you sit down to digital plan. Thank you so much for watching this video today. If you are not on our Facebook group page, I'm pretty sure my iPad just died. <laughs> Y'all, this is a workhorse. I'm on it 24-7. Um, if you are not on our Facebook family, uh, we have tons of inspiration. Lots of customers post tons of stuff, ideas. Um, it's just a great page to be a part of. And we're also on TikTok and Instagram, uh, Facebook, and YouTube. So we have tons of outlets that you can learn how to use good notes, how to use digital planning, and just inspiration and in using stickers and having fun with it. That's what I want you guys to do. Have fun and be productive. Thank you so much for watching today. Happy digital planning and I will catch you on the next video.